Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Frosty. Welcome to Lima with Frosty. This is my first ever YouTube video. And for my first video, what I'm going to be doing is showing you all of the stuff that I have purchased on Amazon and one package from Fashion Nova. I bought a bunch of stuff to start my nail journey. Um, my sister is going to be moving to Georgia possibly, and she's been the person doing my nails, my makeup, my hair, pretty much everything that has to do with making me gorgeous has been done by my sister-in-law. I have learned to do my own hair over the past few years, and now I am going into learning how to do my own nails. And I figure, why not document it, right? I've gotten pretty good at doing my own hair. I do my own makeup. I went to modeling school when I was 14, so I know how to do that, but why do it when someone else can do it for you? And I'm losing the person that does it all for me. So now I have to get back into doing it myself. I know I'm rambling a little bit, so I bought a few things. Some of this stuff I purchased over the past two weeks or so on Amazon and at like Target and Walmart and Walgreens or wherever I can get some of this stuff. Um, I've been watching Nailed by Nikki. I really love her. I'm part of the nail crew. And she gave us a really cool checklist to purchase all of the stuff you would need to start your nail journey. I also bought her stilet almond stiletto nails. And once I get those in the mail, I'm gonna record the unboxing of that and I'll share that with you guys. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is like this cup of random nail care items. I bought a complete pedicure kit at Walgreens and I used the bag to put the sanding bands from the nail drill that I purchased. So I have like a buffing block, a 100, 180 grit that I got out of like a poly gel kit, a buffer, sander, scraper for your feet. I got a nail brush. This is like a file to scrub between your toes. I didn't know that was a thing. I have a nipper, I have a cuticle pusher, I have a regular file, I have some tweezers, a plastic cuticle pusher, another plastic cuticle pusher, another nail file, a pumice stone, a nail clipper, My glass broke. So backstory, this glass, I brought it back from Trinidad Carnival. Um, I got it at the pub house. I don't think I was supposed to take it home, but I kind of brought home a cup from every event and every place that I went to when I went to Trinidad 2020. Um, I may or may not have already posted my Trinidad Carnival 2020 vlog. I'm working on it right now, but I decided to go ahead and record this video so that I can show you guys all the stuff that I got. Cause I just got more stuff in the mail and I'm really excited and I honestly have nothing to do right now. Um, I got some nail glue, this is from Amazon. And there are two brushes like this in here. They are from the nail primer I purchased from Model One. So I bought that on Amazon as well. I'll show it to you guys in a minute. And this is just like a nail dusting brush that came with my nail gel. I bought this regular little black e-file nail drill, whatever you'd like to call it. It was, I believe, $39. I'll insert the price point and stuff from Amazon into the video as soon as I figure out how to do that. Um, it also came with the drill bits that comes with all of the drills and I showed you guys the standing bands. I bought some nail polish remover in that pump up bottle. I bought a bottle of acetone so that I'd be able to soak off my poly gels and take off any polish or clean up any mistakes that I've made. I bought Model One's nail dehydrator and nail primer. They came as a set. I'll insert the price point for you guys and leave a link in the description box. 
for this as well as the other items that I've purchased from like Amazon and everything that I bought on Amazon in the description box so that you can buy it too if you choose to um the next thing that I bought were these little clips I got 10 of them they were like $7.99 $8 and they are to hold on the nail forms when you do poly gels I have tiny fingers as you can see so this is gonna be fun and the next thing I got that I already opened was this box of gel polish by Beatles and it comes in this cute box with a little application guide it like it shows you the instructions and I got four colors it's actually their Christmas kit but I don't care I like it because they're all glitters and I get silver gold red glitter and green glitter but I love glitter as you can see so I'm gonna be using these gel polishes uh, for mostly my accent nails or pretty much all my nails because all of my nails are accent nails and I am full of personality as you are going to learn you don't know because it's my first youtube video but <laughs> you gonna find out <laughs> all right so that's all the things that i already purchased that i have already opened and put in my nail drawer because girl i got a makeup drawer i got a wig drawer i got a nail drawer now i am a jack of all trades i taught myself how to make wigs watching youtube i taught myself how to do my own hair doing youtube I didn't teach myself how to do makeup. I learned that in modeling school when I was 14. But um, I'm self-taught for a few things. I'm going to show you guys is this set of gel polishes I bought on Amazon. And it says CADS Gel Polish 9mm. This is a set not to be sold set. And it's called Small Black Bottle Gel Polish Last. I got six colors. They got it packaged pretty tight here. Whoop. And each box has a little sticker on it. And bam. A little sticker right there. So it kind of shows you the color. But I want to open it. So I'm going to open them. Oh, it also comes with a little thank you card. It says, welcome to my shop. Thanks for your purchase. We would be extremely grateful if you would leave us positive feedback. And it's a little thank you note. Let me know if anything go wrong. Just holla at them. That's really cute. Appreciate y'all. And this is the first color. It says it's 85C. It looks like a nude-ish cute bottle it even has the sticker on top it's not just at the bot on the box i like the bottle a lot Ooh, that is a pretty nude y'all look at that look at that Ooh. all right so that's nude maybe i should open the glitter ones for you guys i might go back and open them but this one looks like a purpley color from the outside. I will show you on the bottle. Boop. Boop. You know you got There is the purpley color. It's like a purpley gray. It's really cool. It's like ash. All right. Sis, sis got eight colors of nail gel so far look at that we coming up we are coming up we just gonna insert these straight in the drawer because once i'm done showing you guys all this stuff i am probably going to play with it and try to do my nails for the first time by myself and i'll probably record that too so you'll get to see me in this shirt in two videos because it happened on the same day uh this one looks like it's a glitter Let's see. Yep, it's like a confetti glitter. Oh my God, look at the hollow! <gasps> hollow! 
So one of the first nail techs that I started watching on YouTube was Simply Nail Logical. And she says, "Hollow low taco, not hollow top coat. And I think that's freaking hilarious. I adore her. Um, let's see. This one, maybe another glitter color. Let's see. It's called Fafo Ayo. It's not focusing. I give. <gasps> Ooh, y'all. It is like black with gold and green. I can't wait to take open up all my stuff. I'm gonna swatch this stuff. Ooh, I'm so excited. Ooh, I am so excited. Oh, it's all right. So the next color, 53L. I ain't said the numbers are no other colors, but these last two. All right, this one's like a gray with silver glitter. All right, this one's Art. like a rare that I saw on Amazon that inspired me to purchase this polish. This one I did see. This one is called 41L. This one I did notice and it's like a white with like black flakes in it. Oh, it's actually clear with white and black flakes. It's like spackled paint. It's really cool. I like that. All right. And those are my gel polishes. I got two sets of gel polish. The next thing I got, kind of random, but like I told you guys, I've been watching Nails by Nikki and she gave us the checklist. She told us to get these little toothbrush keys, not toothbrush, toothpaste keys to use with the poly gel to slide it down so that you use all of your product and you don't waste anything. All right, next box, next box. Next box, next box. Next box, next box. The next box contains my nail tip. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, nail tip, nail tip. And these are short coffin nail tips because I already have really long nail beds naturally. So if I get medium, they look like claws. So I just get short so that I just got a little bit, little, cause my nails already look long and I don't really have to do much. So I'm gonna put those in the drawer. The next thing that's in this box is my light. I got my mini light, hey, I got my light. Hey, 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 hey. And it comes with the light. It comes with a cord does not come with an AC adapter, but I have had multiple smartphones. And this is the instructions. I've had multiple smartphones, so I can definitely just get a block to plug it in or I can plug it into my laptop because I like having extra USB ports around. I'm really happy that that was a mini lamp. I actually thought I bought a full size lamp. But I'm glad it's a mini lamp because I don't have a lot of like desk space to work like and I don't have a lot of outlets so I have to work with what I got so my drill is fairly small it looks my lamp is gonna be small it's right under my ring light which is awesome and it's just big enough for me to fit my whole hand in it perfect I can nuke a finger for 15 seconds it's, it, it works for me it works for what I needed to do. Thing is <gasps> my palette gel. So I actually bought three kinds of palette gel. This is the first set that I've gotten so far. I have purchased I purchased Jershin. I purchased Astound and I purchased one with an S. I'm still waiting for the Astound set to come. 
and I'm still waiting for the one with the S to come. I bought those directly from their website and I bought this one from Amazon so obviously it came first. Um, once they get here I will demo them for you guys. But let's go ahead and get into this box. Look how big the box is and how pretty. All right. Mm. Slide that down, pull that off, fling it over my shoulder. I'll clean it up later. All right. So. Let's see what we got. It's already jumping out at me. All right, honey. Come through with the 30 milliliter bottles. We have a full poly gel set. So it looks like I have one, two, three, four, five, six colors. I have from I have clear. I have white, I have natural pink, I have dark pink, I have copper pink, and I have bean red. It comes with a washable 180, 100 grit file. I have one of those in my nail cup already, so he's gonna go hang out with his friend. It comes with this poly gel brush and spatula. There's the spatula, Nails by Nikki has showed it to us a million times. We all know what one of these look like. And there's the brush. I might play with this today, cause I got tips. And it's Amazon said my hand should be coming in later. It comes with a eight year, poly, poly gel eight years in the making. It comes with an instruction manual. It comes with a really cute thank you card. It says, we are so excited for you to try our Jershin products. We can't wait to see what content you create. Thank you for being part of the Jershin Nail Salon collection campaign. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us. Facebook at Gershin, Gershin Service at Outlook. It comes with a pack of nail forms, which is awesome. I really wanna learn how to use these. And it comes with a pack of dual forms, which is great as well. I wish it came like this instead of like this, because this is a little easier to work with. Um, and I have really tiny fingers, so these are actually really awesome because they look small. Like the other ones, I've been buying poly gel kits and stuff, but not for me, for my sister-in-law, because she does, she's been doing my nails. Um, and the forms have been a little bit bigger, so I like that those are small. It comes with a base coat, soak off gel base coat, and it comes with a soak off gel polish top coat. Um, that's awesome. Hi. Fashion Nova delivery. <laughs> because I've been online shopping, because I've been in the house. Woo! Um, here is the packing slip for seat. All right, first things first. Dark wash. It says, top of my list, the stress jeans, dark wash size nine. <laughs> Your girl's kind of thick. There we go. Okay. Okay, Fashion Nova. Okay. Let me let me climb up here. Let me see what these look like. My booty looks small though. Look like I only got a little bit of booty. That's that sneaky booty on y'all. I look real skinny in these pants. Appreciate y'all for that, Fashion Nova. And that's me letting it out. Suck it in. Whew. All right, time for the next pair. I like where they fall or whatever. They got a 
pretty decent inseam because I'm 5'11". So, all right, the next pair that I got are also a 9'10", and they're these gray jeans. And these are called the right angle skinny jean and they're a size 9, 10 and they're gray. And we gonna try these bad boys on too. Hey, well I tell you, these feel better than them gray jeans in my closet right now. And I only got one leg in. Oh my God. I feel hey. the material. See, this um, all right, I so like this welcome back. Let I'm me go ahead and text you, and that's when they turn that off. So, I got the last thing from my packages for today. Ooh. I'm gonna open this and then I'm gonna go back to trying on the jeans and stuff from Fashion Nova. This is supposed to be my professional drill belt bits. That's what this is. Uh -huh. And this has those pretty, oh, I could fit the whole other set of drill bits in here too. But it has the pretty ones, the rainbow drill bits, and all the safety ones for your cuticles. And then the ceramic carbide ones to take off the chunky acrylic and then the brush one. So that's really cute. But this is what I've been waiting for all day. I've been waiting for my hands. I've been waiting for my hands. And they finally set my hands. I gotta pay a white lady hand. White lady hand. I got they different sizes. The year girl. These these two different women. These not even the same woman. And then I have the big brown hand that everybody else uses coming in later. The hands came. Let's finish trying on these pants. And I kind of already painted one of my feet with the gel polish. And sis, sis toes is dry. The lamp work. Look, we got a nice little. Here's my workout working area hand one but uh, I can't get the hands to work but I'm gonna figure it out like this one's a big hand and this was like a baby hand I mean like I'm gonna figure it out I'm gonna figure out how to make this work for me so that I can practice until that brown practice hand that everybody else has comes in next week but we out here. I'm gonna throw that in. And then I don't have any acrylic yet to practice doing nail forms, which I think these hands would be good for, for me to practice these. And I think I should buy like a roll of 500 of these. I think they gave me like 50 or 100. Hopefully they gave me like 100 with the poly gel kit. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna continue to try on pants. These are the gray pants from Fashion Nova. I did not take them off. They are a size 9, 10. And sis, I'm 5'11". My pants are at my ankles. Like, that never happened. Never. Not on the first. This, these ones are Kendra Roll Cup Skinny Jeans in medium blue in a size 9. This one doesn't say 9 slash 10 like the other ones. This one just says 9. And then these, hope they stretch because these, these not looking like they fit Cindy. These, these don't look like they fit Frosty. They don't. Like, high waist. The way they say. I do a little dance. I got to do a lot of dance. Make a lot of love to get in these tonight. I lied on them. Oh, they zipped up real good. Hold on now. I lied on them. I'm not, how they doing? They not as good. So they don't come up in the back the same way. And these are ankle. All right, so we gonna stand up on these. Get y'all a 360. 
we doing all right in the booty area mm -hmm. pretty v butt cheeks mm -hmm. all right and then these are cuffed so they're ankle i'm probably gonna unhem them i'm probably gonna but I really wanted this color, so I bought it rolled up already. Because I'm slowly getting dark blue, sis. That's jean three of five. Right now, they two for, they two for three. Like, I'm not absolutely in love with these roll cuffed ones. But I really like the color. But the fit on the first two jeans that I tried on from Fashion Nova was phenomenal. Like, these have a pretty good fit. But I guess because they're lighter denim, I don't know if that's actually why. I might be making this up. They were a little bit harder to pull up. So maybe they have less lycra in them than the other ones do. But this one was just a little bit more work to get off. Right. Another pair that... So these ones, they're called Blue Jam. And then the ones that fit me better so far are Fashion Nova's actual brand. Like the label says Fashion Nova. So I have noticed that the ones that actually say Fashion Nova have been fitting me better. And these are your run of the mill, classic, dark blue, everyday jean. Like, yes. you ship, ship me the leg in. Ship me that leg in. And you button? Honey. 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 Honey, honey, Fashion Nova. I've been playing myself. Let me sit down. I have been playing myself. I have to stop being cheap. Jeans that do this right here. Look at that. My whole ass is in my pants. I'm, si I'm sitting down. My ass is still in my pants. Look, look, no butt crack. My ass is still in my pants. Y'all don't understand. I am 5'11 with a high sitting bottom. Pants don't have the inseams that I need. Pants don't got the, what, what's this? This, the crack seam? They, they don't be adding up for the torso that I got. So for these pants to be buttoned past my belly button and be cinching my waist, Honey, I've been playing myself. Because I'm, I'm always cute on a budget, like, always. My outfits be A1 and $10. But I've been playing myself because these jeans are everything right now. I had one pair of jeans that fit me like this. That was these this dark blue. It's still in my closet and I won't give it up. It is a pair of dark blue Banana Republic jeans that I bought at Nordstrom's Off The Rack. And I've had those jeans for like seven years. They ripped. They got a hole in the thigh. I refuse to throw them away. I can throw them away now, friend. Look, I can throw them away. Look, look. I can throw them away. Look at my butt. Look. Friend, look. And then look, it come all the way down to my ankle. Since being 5'11", this don't happen. And these like the regular ones. I didn't buy size nine. So I'm not gonna try these on. I mean, I should, but I'm not. Mostly cause they're white. All right, so like I said, I'm not gonna try these on because they're white and I usually like to like wear my white stuff fresh out. The thing I got from Fashion Nova is this shirt. It's just a regular black t-shirt. Let's go ahead and try it on for try it on sake. I can see it now. Ooh, auntie, I like that shirt. I'm finna come take that whole outfit because that's my niece's reaction to any outfit of mine that they like. 
they come to my house to shop in my closet. Oh, I like that shirt. I like the way it fit. I like the way it just fell right in the place. Covered up my sports bra. What sports bra? Oh, I got it filthy. Deodorant. Oh, deodorant hack. Cotton takes it off. You want a black shirt on the black shirt. And now to take the deodorant off. So because these pants are high waist, I feel like I should tuck my shirt in. Because it just looked like I'm all kinds of bloated and stuff. And it's too much lines in my belly. Shirt too fitted. There we go. That looks better. Oh, so y'all, we probably gonna be working out on this channel too then. Cause I can't be trying on clothes for y'all and I'm busting over the top of the pants. I'm not I'm I'm not a muffin top kind of gal. Uh, I'm not. I'm not even gonna hold y'all. Like I don't like I love my body and how I look, but I wanna be cute when I get dressed all the way. I wanna be like I wanna be the girl all oh, other girls wanna look like. So we need to get this gone. My friends be like, what are you talking about? You don't have any fat. And I be like this, Whew. I force it. But I feel cute. This outfit's nice. I feel really like, I got some boots I can put on with this. I got some knee high boots. I got some thigh high boots. I got my gold chain. This video is really over. I'm really just rambling at this point. Um, what I'm gonna do at this I'll point. see you guys later. Thanks for watching my YouTube video. Like, comment, subscribe. Please subscribe. Welcome to the first video. Thanks for joining. Lyman with Frosty.